Here I am again at Satisfactory. This is the refactor episode because I got sick of having a giant train station down here that all it was doing was shuttling stuff from here up to here. So I took out the giant train station up here. As you can see, it's gone. And uh, I replaced it with conveyor belts. So there's there's all these conveyor belts that do the job of the train station. I, I should never have built the thing down there. It was, it was dumb. That was a dumb decision. And now it's fixed. So, uh, yeah, this is basically the same as it was before, except now it doesn't have uh, a four-car train station here that just shuttles stuff back and forth. Instead, it's got all these conveyor belts. I feel like I said that already. All right, well, anyway, uh, that's this thing. But wait, there's more. There's more things that I've refactored. But I'll have to get back to my main base to do that, so see you in a second. Well, I'm on the way. I figured I'd go over an overview of stuff have changed since last main overview video. Uh, this is where that last video was over here in the, the uh, weird crystal flower jellyfish cave. I put a train station here up on the big platform. I figured that would be useful late in the end game if there's like some boss monsters and stuff up there. Is it mostly just um, alumina? Or, uh, aluminum? What is it? Um, bauxite. Yeah, bauxite spots up there. Which are cool, but I don't need them because I've got all the aluminum that I can handle right now. Uh, put in an oil platform here. It's got five train cars of oil. I'm not using it for anything yet. Uh, I'll show you the stuff I did with the water, but I'm using this water station now. Explored up here. Put up a radar tower. Explored uh, down here in the valleys. Found the, the thing underneath the, the archway. I'd never seen that before. That's pretty cool. Uh, what else? There's some more Sam ore all over the place. It looks like Sam ore now, at least some of the spots, are infinite, or or they have a lot more production. Uh, yeah. So, it, this is, big game's basically over. I just wanted to refactor my base a bit to make it cleaner and, and uh, yeah, not quite so messy. So here I am back at my main base. This is down in the the area where I first started. In fact, I think this is still my first iron plate factory that's uh, been sitting here in the first iron plate storage bin. Um, but there used to be a big concrete factory down here. Tore it all out. Tore it all out because I moved it up here, turned it into a wet concrete factory. And uh, also I've got this big... Well, actually, let's go up to the tower and then we can see this better. But, uh, but concrete factory and what is this? Pure iron ingot factory. Okay, remember that stuff. <laughs> I wanted to, to show this. So I've got this real tall tower for looking at things and uh, it used to take a real long time to get up there. So I, I built one of these uh, newfangled linear railgun things. And uh, it really it really helps. It makes it take a, a much shorter amount of time. <laughs> Doink, <laughs> there we are. Oh boy. Okay, so here is the base. There's that big water station. The wet concrete factories on the far side there and the uh, more efficient iron ingot uh, plant is over there. This is my new and improved copper sheet factory. All it does is make copper sheets. It's got one uh, Mark III back there on a pure ore node. It's only half optimize like it's it's only using half of the, the ore available um just because i didn't want to build like 24 constructors but it's got the four refineries and they're overclocked uh to 100 200 percent each back there and so that's one of the main things i did that's one of the main things i did is i built all that stuff tore out a bunch of this stuff down in the basement um I rerouted some of the the conveyor belts didn't didn't reroute everything. I don't really have a, a sense for where exactly I want all this stuff. I feel like I should redo this at some point. This is kind of a mess over here. All the rubber, uh, all the rubber factories, and uh, what? I recolored some things. Um, yeah, there's the water train. So there's the the water plant with all the the water pumps, and that dumps out here. And I think. I think I don't need anything else on that one. Oh, there's something else I want to point out. So there's uh, 25, I think, um, of these coal 
burning power plants, well, the, including these over here. So including those and all these, 25 of them. And all put together, those produce uh, three quarters the amount of power of one nuclear power plant. So just give a sense of like, nuclear power plants have huge overhead as far as complexity goes, but they're also incredibly power dense. So that's fun. Um, let's jump in this rail gun. So this rail gun just goes up to the top of the tower. Uh, and I figured out that if you take out the last stand in the series uh, here, then it still works and uh, you can get out when you're done. Otherwise you get stuck and you have to deconstruct it anyway. But if you just don't rebuild it, then it's fine, it works. So this goes over to my, uh, just give you a sense how fast these things are. This goes over to this oil plant here. So this is, you know, a good third of the way across the map. And let's see how long it takes to run down here. Okay, so there's my whole factory. Uh, there it is fading to the distance. Oh, I should probably turn around so we can see where we're going. Oh, it's too late. We're already there. <laughs> so, <laughs> so there's, so that was, I don't know how long that was. Not long. Uh, and that's with 14, I think. I think maybe I have... 16 on this one, I forget. But 14 will, will get you uh, all the way over there. It also, if you point straight up, will get you as high or, or significantly higher than the, um, the platform on the space elevator. But I tried to land on it, it killed me. I'm guessing that's intentional. Um, but anyway, yeah, rail guns, very fun. Uh, use a lot of power, but mm, got plenty to spare. Although, ooh, not as much as I used to. Wow really eating it up. Nine. Huh. I guess all those refineries are uh, using a lot of power. Here we go. Zoop, 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 zoop. <laughs> oh, it's fun. All right. So that's it. That's the, the refactor so far. Hopefully, I will have more refactoring done soon. Um, is there anything else? Oh, I also added a bunch of deck over here. Uh, but that doesn't really change much. Like, it's, it's just more decking over the top, so it's a little cleaner, all this stuff here. And a few ramps. There's ramps here, ramps down there. Ramps here and there. So, uh, yeah, there it is. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to be back to Satisfactory uh, anytime soon. I've kind of exhausted all this, uh, everything that I wanted to do got the the high efficiency iron refineries going high efficiency copper refineries going high efficiency uh, concrete refineries going and uh, yeah I don't really need anything else at this point oh I switched this over switched over oh, we can go take a look at that real quick switched over the reinforced heavy frame or whatever heavy modular frame these things heavy encased frame heavy modular frame switch it over to the alternate thing so it uses concrete instead of um, screws and then I took down a whole bunch of screw factories because screw factories right okay I'm done see you guys later